former MSU football players that have been sentenced in a sexual assault case. Donnie Corley Jr., Demetric Vance, and Josh King took a plea deal and will receive probation. They're on probation for 36 months. 7 Action News reporter Nia Harden is live in the newsroom to tell us what happened today in the courtroom. Well, Keenan, the three pleaded guilty to a lesser charge of seduction of an unmarried woman. While some of their attorneys tried to say the players did nothing wrong, the judge saw things differently and wanted to make sure the players stayed out of the courtroom for good. I want the record to be made clear that Mr. Vance did not rape anyone on that night. It is disturbing to me. I understand that you're a zealous advocate. That's your job. But what you have done is completely refuted everything which tells me we ought to go to trial. Three former MSU football players will not serve jail time after being accused of sexual assault. In January 2017, the three were accused of raping a woman in a bathroom at an on-campus party. While the players say they made bad decisions, they reject raping the woman. I became terrified to sleep because of the persistent nightmares. The victim had her attorney read a letter to the court. My wish for these defendants is that they come face to face with all the pain they've caused for myself and those I love and that they face it with some level of humanity and empathy. Her parents also shared their thoughts. Sadly, this case represents everything that is wrong with the environment at Michigan State University, especially in the athletics department. I feel like I was just in a bad situation. We could have avoided this. Vance, Corley, and King were sentenced to 36 months of probation, sex offender treatment, therapy, and 100 hours of community service. The judge making it very clear she doesn't want to see them again. Nothing will mature you faster than prison, and no one will send you quicker than me. Now, all three players will be going to college in Mississippi this year. If they don't complete these terms, they can be sentenced to up to five years in jail. Nia Harden, 7 Action News.